cream. We're going to the vet right now. Not a C-section, but a reverse progesterone. We gotta drive out of town. We're gonna be closed for the holidays. So I wanna see where she's at. I wanna get stuck with another ER visit. So I got a couple of vets on call, but um, progesterone toes, uh, reverse progesterone. Check where it up. It's pretty much, um, it's like a female, her, um, her dilating number. I've talked about it before. So um, that's where we're going. It's like day 57. We only did one AI, so I know we're early, but um, I always wanna, you wanna be on the safe side. You don't wanna open up a dog. Hey, too early, definitely not. But she's loaded. Yeah, so here we go, Dr I heard driving, man, it's crazy. I heard I got my wiper, look at the right. Wiper's about to fly off. Driving all the way to out of town, get my dog tested. Back there, she already took a poop. Kind of smells up in here. The stuff you gotta do that people don't even have one clue. They just see puppies and they think you're rich. All right, guys, so I brought cream in for a reverse progesterone test at my vet. That's the price, you know. I go to the vet, I go legit, that's my, my vet. And she came back at a 5.2 NG, right? So that's, today is the 20, what, 23rd? That's within 72 hours, she's done. You know, that's their speculation that she'll have puppies. I honestly think she'll be ready tomorrow night. So 5.2, in order for them to open her, open her up, they need her at a three, under a three, anything under a three. So honestly, I've been through here. I've been through this, I mean. Uh, so here we go again, you know. This is the struggle that I gotta go through, man. It's always in the holidays. Got the pet brooder out. Do some maintenance real quick. Look at that dirty air filter. How to install a new one, clean the little unit for these puppies. So I went to the vet today and they said uh, they're not ready yet till tomorrow. So I'm getting some stuff ready. I don't want to get uh, caught up last minute. This is last minute right here, shoot. But um, anyway, that's to be done. Uh, make sure it works. The puppies arrive. Three, two creams, a blue male or female. Cream's a female, got two females, one male, so. Um, yeah, Cream had her puppies. We had to come out here to uh, South County Vet out here in Selma, waiting for Mama. Got my nephew in there waiting. Um, yeah, man. Good thing they're open on Christmas Eve. You know, hopefully, I got some healthy puppies. Gotta get them home. The incubator, throw my mama. These are the puppies. This is day two. Mama's doing so great. She has milk. I'm thankful God really helped me out on this one. I can remember in the last video, uh, my Merle female had a, a litter and she had no milk. So I was doing different methods using the nipple tower. And I had a bunch of Karens in the comments talking all kinds of mess. But um, we did oxytocin, tried to help produce milk on Mama. She didn't have none. So I had to do what I had to do. I mean, it works for me. I'm not forcing anybody to do my methods. I'm just... If you're in that situation, you can benefit from it. My females, my dogs from that litter thrive. You know, I had issues with the whelper, so you know I'm whelping my own puppies this time. And once you have, if you have a female that has milk, you know that's all you can ask for. The rest, you know, you have to put in the work, right? So um, this is just the way I do things. I just I hop out that one person who needs help and can't get advice from anybody, you know. If you, you guys are more than welcome to, I, I believe on the link below, I put um, my uh, social media account. You guys can DM me and stuff. I don't mind helping out people who, you know, who are seeking it. I'm not here for uh, other people who have negative stuff to say. And um, I'm going to let you guys go, you know, probably tune in later because these guys need my help. So thanks for tuning in, guys. And, you know, I'm thankful. You have a mama with milk. The rest is on you.
So those wondering how much did I pay for my C-section on Christmas Eve. Uh, that's, that's how much I paid. Show, but um, that's where I went for cream c-section South County Veterinary Hospital in uh, Selma California so if you're in the valley nearby uh, they did a good job so again that's how much I paid 702 as you guys know last time I'm um, on Black Merle I had three puppies I had more but uh, I had issues with my woke uh, I took her to the ER on Fresno and I paid up front was 45 then they reimbursed me it was like 2400 but um 702 they did a great job at soma i had a bad experience one time but um they uh they're the only ones open available so i mean i had no choice but man uh, they did it real good mom mom wasn't all uh drugged out anesthesia she she was unconscious she was walking so i appreciate it so yeah um south county that hospital and uh soma did a great job i do recommend them so again they're located in selma california uh thanks for tuning in um and you guys have a, a, a great new year's peace